Hello everyone, how you doing? Welcome again to Tech UK and another GT Sport. Lots of GT content uh, recently, which I'm really, really happy with. I love playing the game. We've had every single month now, pretty, no, actually every single month, we're getting free content. It's not always the track, but we get free content every single month with this game. And that's happening for the last two years, amazingly. This month looks pretty sweet. We've got seven cars, a brand new, uh, brand new track, uh, and some changes as well, which we're going to go through now. So, <laughs> did you sleep in there? I know, Farmer. I know. I know. Let's say some hellos. We've got Madman, Cal's in here. Hello, Benny. Hello, Sab. we got new uh, new image. Gods is in here. Wardy. Farmer Slim. we got Tommy. Uh, Aaron's here. How are you all doing? So, what I'm going to do is we're going to look at each car. We're going to chat about the content itself. The uh, There's a few updates. A few um, The penalties have been fixed, apparently. Um, where if you hit someone, you don't get the penalty. Um, and then I think I will do the track experience for Laguna Seca and then maybe at the end we'll open up a lobby and you can all dive in and we can have a bit of a race together. I've got my massive cup of tea so I'm going to have a nice cup of tea with you if that's alright. So what are we all thinking about Gran Turismo at the moment? My opinion is, to be honest with you, I've never enjoyed playing it more than I have at the moment. It's crazy, it's just, it's just I don't know, it's just coming into its own even more after two years. I think the future for GT Sport is just absolutely amazing. Hello, Pete. Yeah, it says here, let me, let's read that out about the penalty while, while we're talking about that. It says, um, oh god, I've got to find it now. Fixed an issue in Gran Turismo Sport wherein penalties incurred due to a collision could be transferred to another player in sport mode and lobbies. Penalty times have been adjusted accordingly. So hopefully, um, hopefully that, that won't happen. It happened to me a few times yesterday, didn't it? Someone got a penalty, hit me, and then suddenly I've got it. Why don't you like the new track, Pete? Funnily enough, if I if I associate a track with a game, I don't know why, probably because that's where I played it most, I associate the Gunda Seca with Forza. Weird. You know, I used to play it a lot on Forza. Obviously never played it on this Gran Turismo. But yeah, if I think of Laguna Seca, I always think of the, one of the old Forzas. Um, Forza 4 or 5, maybe? It's cool, though. Can't, yeah, good. It'd be good to have you in here, Slim. Yeah. Yeah, instead of a one-second penalty, you get a ten-second penalty. Yeah, exactly. Well, you've only just had a go, haven't you, Pete? It's, a very, it's probably one of the most technical tracks in the world. The elevation change, um, the sand on the track because it's in the middle of the desert. It's it is absolute. It's one of the hardest tracks in the world, probably. And you got that corkscrew as well. You know, it's a big old. It's a big pro track, but it's usually easy to get the hang of. It's like it's like anything. They're only corners, aren't they? They're easy to to get the hang of, but hard to master. Um, not on the stream, it's not even plugged in, Madman. <laughs> right, let's go through the cars. Now, in the tradition of these little patch notes, which we've been doing, um, yeah, and in Project Gotham as well, yeah, in the tradition of these patch note streams, um, I will move this cup in a minute, in the tradition of these patch note streams, we have a chat about the car, and I ask you in the chat if it's a yes or no, not based on the car itself, but whether we think it should be in Gran Turismo and if it was a good introduction into the game. So let's start with that. Right, okay, we've got... Now, interestingly, I've just read on here, I don't know if you're aware of this, but these um, these safety cars, apparently, they're not available straight away. They're, they're only available through the mileage exchange. And they're not available straight away, which is which is a bit strange. I don't I don't understand that to be honest with you. Um, it says here each safety car can only be purchased at the mileage exchange. Please note these cars will not appear in the showroom within Brand Central, which is fine. Which is fine. The release schedule uh, for the safety cars after 1.53. So 24th of December, we're getting the Dodge Charger Hellcat. The 31st of December, we're getting the Renault Sport. And Tuesday, the 7th of January, we're getting a selection of randomly selected safety cars, including the BMW safety car and Mercedes AMG. So we're not getting them straight away. So have we got the Dodge? Because otherwise, it is actually only six cars. Let's have a look. So let's go to um, mileage exchange. Who wants them anyway? Well, I'm, I'm trying to put together in my mind a little game mode where we can... Um, we can put them as police cars. That's what I, I, I'm trying to think of another little game mode. Yeah. 
Yeah, cops and robbers. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, so I'm trying to think of something that we, which used to be in Forza, didn't it? But I'm trying to think of something we could do in Gran Turismo. So look, is that an old one or is that an old one, that Mercedes Benz? I don't think that's one of the new ones, is it? So I don't think the Dodge, the Dodge Charger is actually available yet, which is uh, very weird. Yeah, it is old, but I'm just trying to think of something that we can play in Gran Turismo. Do we get the dress up? Yeah, exactly. Um, look in the car list. Oh, okay. That's, well, in mileage exchange. Says on the 24th. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. Yeah, so we've only got actually one, two, three, four, four. We've only got six cars. Yeah, that's not a problem. Yeah, it said on the 24th and then one on um, New Year's Eve as well. Right, let's go to the first car. Which is the Ford GT17. Let's have a look at that. <clears throat> oh, that's a long list, gods. It's long. It's long. Right, okay. So, like I say, in the tradition of these little streams, what do we think of having that in the game? I always forget to look at how much it is. Half a mil. Okay, half a mil. What are we thinking about this? Is it a yes or is it a no? I think it's a yes. I mean, it's it's a lovely car, isn't it? That you can't deny the beauty of that car. Hello, Snowy. It will break down. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, it will. Looks lovely, doesn't it? And then we. Oh my God! Look at the change in that. Yeah, it looks lovely in blue. But you chuck that in red and it instantly screams supercar, doesn't it? I know, red. I'm just addicted to red cars, yeah. And then I always like to play this game. Yeah, I know you can chuck a livery on there and we most definitely will. But if you... These are period colours, right? So these are the um, colours that are available when you brought the car. And I just don't like to immerse myself and think, well, what colour would I actually choose it? What colour? Ice white would oh ice white with a blue stripe would be really really nice wouldn't it? Hello Liam, how are you? Let's see the blue stripe. Oh god, I think it would have to be that, wouldn't it? Just looks classic, doesn't it? But then saying that that looks the thing is when you get a beautiful car, all colours look good, don't they? I mean, oh I'm not sure about that black with the orangey red. Mm, no, I don't like that. I do like the blue. And would I, you know, again, you're in the showroom, right? You're just about to put your money down and you've chosen blue. And they say to you, you know, would you, would you have the, do you want the stripe? And you're like, oh shit, I don't know. Do I want the stripe? Would you have the stripe? So if you went with blue, literally it's now or never that, you know, it's going to be put on at the factory. Would you have the stripe? Or would you just have it like that? Oh God, it's hard, isn't it? It is hard. I, part of me thinks, no, just leave it exactly as it is. Part of me thinks, of course have the stripe. Of course have it. Stripes on everything, yeah. Let's see what yellow with black. Oh, that that's pretty good. Stripe, blue, no stripe, yeah. That car has to have a stripe. I think so, yeah. I think it is a stripe every time. I'll tell you what, I'm going to go, like I say, I know we're going to put a livery on it in the future, but you got the money, <laughs> buy all of them. Oh, I will. Oh, I definitely will. And because I've been doing lots of um, uh, daily races and all this, that and the other, we've actually got a decent amount of money today. Let's buy it in the blue with the silvery white stripe. So that was a yes from everyone, wasn't it? Yep, yeah, I brought it for you, Aaron. The stripe does look good, yes. Right, we'll be using that. That's fine. Next up, which is... I'm not a big fan of Porsche, but I'm excited to have this car in the game. That makes no sense. I'm sure that you're all going to say this is a yes. I, can't, I don't think anyone would not say um, that this is a yes. It makes it faster. Yeah, exactly. Uh, let's have a look at this one. I'm sure it's a yes. It's got to be a yes. Right, it's half a mil. Is that a yes or is that a no? It, like I say, and I don't mean it horribly, I mean they're beautiful cars, but I just don't really go much on Porsche, I really don't. But saying that, I've been looking at a few of the pictures um, when I knew this was coming and oh god it is lovely isn't it? It really is, it really is nice. Save money for the Golf, yeah. Again, what colour? Not blue, no, not blue. Ice white or... um. 
little bit of silver, yes, probably the white, probably, <laughs> madman, yeah, <laughs> the glasses will help. The white looks beautiful, though. It, although in a kind of funny way, it sort of shows its age when it's white, because white is a sort of oldish colour, isn't it? Yeah, I'm just not a big Porsche fan. My wife, I mean, she's not a car fan as such. Anyway, she loves a Porsche. She loves it, and I'm like, I just, I just don't see it. You know, I just don't see it. But I can respect that for what it is, regardless of what badge that has got on the front. Let's have a look at black. Yeah, definitely, Cal. Yeah. Is that beef, Cal? Are you, is that beef, Cal? Is that the same person? Black looks really nice. I think it's going to be yellow, you know. Yeah, I thought it was, Cal. Um, I think it's going to be yellow. I think it's got to be yellow. It just screams like, fuck off, doesn't it? <laughs> <laughs> fuck off! That's what it screams to me. You like the black? Let's have a look at the black in the daytime. Show me it in the daytime. No, I don't think it is red on this one. No, I don't think it is red. No, no. The black looks stylish, doesn't it? There's no doubt about that. Right, finally, finish my tea. It's a big wing on the back, and I'm interested, hopefully, fingers crossed, it's got an interior view, and you look, at, look out and just see nothing apart from that fucking ironing board on the back. <laughs> Get out, love. Do the ironing on the back there. Uh, I'm going to go yellow. Yeah, I'm going to go yellow. I'm still not getting a decent look at black in the daytime. I want to see what it looks like in the daytime. Come on, show us black. Here we go. Oh, God, it could be black. Is it black or is it yellow? Is it black or yellow? Hello, Franch. I think it's yellow. Yeah, I'm going yellow. Like I say, of course, we're only messing around here. You can put whatever colour you want afterwards. But I like to choose the colour out of the showroom. Right, so we've had two yeses so far. That's interesting. Right, the next one is another safety car, but we can't see that yet because it hasn't actually been released yet, which is a bit weird. It's a bit weird. Right, the next one, I'm not sure if it's going to be yes on or not. I, I've got no idea. I've got no idea. Hello, Fubar. Matt Black, yeah, that'd be nice. Right, okay. I think I know what you're going to say. The Crown Athlete G. It's N300. It's 57,000. What do we think of that? <laughs> what do we think of that? <laughs> Why? It's pig fucking ugly, mate. Hello, Daz. What the fuck? No, there could be... See, this is this is why I like discussing it like this. You see, because it's like, well, why did, why did they put that in? Why? I mean, you could name, uh, thank you, Sean. You could name a thousand cars better than that. Come on, what are you doing? <laughs> Athlete, yeah, exactly. <laughs> no, that's not for me. I'm not even going to buy it. Championship material, absolutely not. No. Yeah, they do shoot themselves in the foot a little bit, because a lot of people say, you know, yeah, it's GT Sport, right? Yeah, we want normal cars, but we want things like Super Impressors, road cars that are done. What the fuck? It, who's going to who's gonna race that? Unless that is in a daily race, I can't see that that car will ever get used. So all that, all that design time, they reckon it takes a couple of months to make each car now. I'm sure it's a lovely car. In has anyone actually heard of the Toyota Crown? I'm sure it's obviously said it's obviously listed as something else in Europe. Is it the Avensis, for example? I don't know. I've got no idea. Yeah, you're right, Paul. Actually, yeah, the sort of thing manufacturers and maybe they pay for the development time. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Yeah, <laughs> road cars are already meh, nah, but this is beyond bad. You're right. Yeah, yeah. I think cars are uh, like a luxury. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. No, I'm not even going to buy it, to be honest with you. Now, the next one is another Toyota Crown Af uh, Athlete safety car. Ooh, but it's not available yet. What a weird update. They said there's seven cars, but there's not. There's actually four cars. Yeah, there's four cars, because the rest are going to be um, dropped at p particular dates, like Christmas Eve, New Year's Eve. Really weird. Why not put them in? Yeah, weird. Um, the next one, and the last one... <laughs> Which I think I think is a yes. I think you'll say um, <laughs> you'll win one and still hate it. Yeah, exactly. I think you'll like this one. 
I think it's a yes. I know, John. I know. Right, Mark 1 Golf. N100. For me, absolutely yes. And yes, that has got a, either a championship or um, at least a GT Royale written all over it. And it's going to be in red. Not because I like red, because I associate that car with red. I think most of the colours chosen for that was red, wasn't it? It's a lovely little car. I always loved it. I mean, I, mean, I don't know if you're the same sort of age as me, but you could go and buy a little Escort or maybe even a Vauxhall Nova, but you could not get a Golf GTI for decent money. There was just this thing about Golfs at that particular time. And I think now to a certain extent, but there was there was just something about them that um, just held their money so well. Yeah. Looks like a box. I know, Pete, but come on. It's a classic box, isn't it? Need some aftermarket wheels, yeah. XR2 would be good. Yes, yes, yeah. No, that is, that's pure classic. Pure, pure classic. Also remember that Golf GTI, they've always had good adverts as well, haven't they? Especially that most recent one where it's like an animal. Um, but I remember even back in the day for them, they always had good uh, good adverts. Back in the day, I know, well it is, it's 1983. <laughs> 1983 for me actually sounds quite recent, but it's <laughs> it's quite a while ago. Mark 1 Scirocco, or Scirocco. Wow, did you? Yeah, that you'd like one of them now, wouldn't you? If only everything in life was as reliable. Yeah, exactly. I'm going to go red. I'm going to go red. Your wife was born in 1984. She's lovely, Joey. She started off a good bit of fun last night with her, with her kebab suggestion. Well, I'm just look, I'm looking at my phone here because I've got the patch notes on. I'm just seeing if there's anything else. So, um, like I say, the... Um, the safety cars are being dropped at particular days. I don't understand that. So Christmas Eve, we're going to get the Dodge Charger. New Year's Eve, we're going to get the Sport McGann. And the 7th of January, we're going to get the rest. Very, very weird. We've got some new stuff in campaign mode. The corkscrew has been added to scapes. Um, we've got a new option, apparently. Let's go and see if we can find it. Let's go and see if we can find it. It's a vibration function, which I thought we already had in, really. But let's have a look. Get to Saker. I will. I will. I'm going to do some of the... Um, uh, what's it called? Track experience. Uh, let's have a look. Controllers. Vibration function. Oh, okay. It's literally on or off, is it? Okay. Yeah, so they've added that. Yeah, they've added that. Yay! <laughs> um... Other adjustments, fix that penalty where it, your penalty could get um, transferred to someone else. And I think that's pretty much it. Yeah, yeah, I think that's it. Right, okay, so let's go and do a little bit of track experience. Open up, um, open up a lobby so we can have a bit of a race together. And then uh, I'm going to go off and do some stuff. Some real life stuff. Right, let's have a look here. They don't normally add circuit experience straight away, do they? D you know, or from what I can remember, don't they add that like the next month? But they put it in with the track this time, so that's cool. Right, we're all with a dodge. Yeah, yeah, you said about that, Sab, didn't you? Right, let's go. We've got people on there already. Graham's had a go already. Look, 33. Let's see if we can beat it. You degenerate. Mark, I'm too busy racing with my beautiful community to worry about things like that. Yeah, it may be, Cal. Yeah. <clears throat> I'm going through and getting them done, though. I know, Benny, it's amazing, isn't it? What a game. And, and they're reaping the benefits now because the community, I think, is at an all-time high. The eSports program is at an all-time high. And it just, you know, it just means that the next Gran Turismo is going to be huge. What does vibration function do? Well, it turns the vibration on or off on your controller. Hello Chief, how are you? Right, let's turn the traction off. And we will have a slow look around, but let's just see first how we get on with this version. Last time I played Laguna Seca was in um, Race Room, actually. Yeah, that's how long it's been. Oh no, tell a lie, no, tell a lie. We got this on the truck game, haven't we? Oh, it changes the strength for the controller as well. Oh, okay. It just says in the description there you can turn it on or off. Wow. 
Wow. Okay. I got it. I got it. Hello, Ryan. Oh, too slow there. Come on, Jason. What are you doing? What are you doing? <coughs> well, you just keep trying, Pete. You just keep trying. You're not going to... You, you're certainly not going to get it first time, are you? I think you've got to go wide on it, if I remember, to take both apexes. Yeah. Oh my god, I'm rusty this morning. Wow. Right, okay, I'm back on it. <coughs> right, let's get that traction right off. We don't need that. It does look good. We'll go to a uh, lobby in a minute so we can uh, we can have a good look around it. Hello, Codus. How you doing? Just woke up, busy down ahead. What you got planned? More multi screen ESO. Just missed it there. Oh no, I got it. Yeah, yeah, cool. Um, any updates on PlayStation 4? Well, I've covered the last couple of updates. I'm just going to do that again. I'm sure I can get a better time than that. Um, but no, they won't be online for ages, if ever. Yeah. Quick hand, Shandy. He's going to have a kebab. Yeah. Oh, he missed the fun last night. He missed the fun. Right, one more and then we move on to the next one. Hello Archie, how are you? And then we're going to get in that Porsche. God, I must be tired today. Come on. Well, we've got a gold. We'll uh, we'll move on to the next one. We'll whip through these and then we'll set up a lobby. Recoup some of my money. <laughs> so what new... Um, what's the up... Oh, vacant and shipment maps. Oh, okay. They're doing well with the old maps, aren't they? So we'll open up the lobby in a minute, we'll have a good slow look around the track, and then uh, we'll get some lads in here. Looking good though. Can't wait to race around here, we need a long race around here, don't we? A really long race. Oh yeah, 
Yeah, that is looking good. Look at that. Oh shit, this is such a hard track though, isn't it? Oh god, I remember. Oh shit. I fell for it. <laughs> I've just been playing uh, mostly uh, a bit like Gran Turismo, really, just community stuff, um, private matches, so I'm not really ranking up, but I enjoy the game. Oh, too soon, too soon. Oh, I love the tyre marks they've done, that's cool. Right, we can get a gold there, we just need to work on that corner. Yeah, definitely Beard, yeah, we, we, we will spectate some people. Um, we'll do it all, we'll do it all. We'll try and fit in as much as we possibly can. Ah, oh, just missed out there. Come on. <clears throat> yeah, the old cod is good. It is good. Oh shit! Fucking hell, I must be tired today. It must be. It's all good. It's all good. We'll open up a lobby in a minute. Yeah, literally just started, um, Cat. Yeah, but yeah, it's all good. Yeah, definitely beard, yeah. Boom, right, we've got a gold there, let's do the next one then. Oh, look at that, after the money, and I've still got three mil. Wow, that's unusual. So dramatic, that music, isn't it? <laughs> right, one more, and then uh, we'll do a... Uh... A lobby. You can all come in. Super Formula. Yeah, that would be good round here. There's so many cars that would suit round here. Everything from a track day sort of thing. Like, you know, the Super Impressors all the way to um, LMP1s, racing cars, GT3, GT4. Right, here we go. Everyone got your seatbelts on <laughs> for the corkscrew. Oh, fucking hell. Whoa. I got it. I'll still get a gold. Oh, this one's taking us right up to the end. Oh, shit. <laughs> Bloody hell. <laughs> Stand up cars. It's probably the Porsche. Yeah, it's probably the Porsche, to be honest with you. We've got a lot of um, safety cars, but they're not dropping straight away, which is a bit weird. They're going to be drip fed over the, over the next um, next month. Oh god, that don't seem right to me. The other wow, that don't seem right. I'm sure it is. <laughs> it seems a lot tighter in than I remember it. That's what she said. <laughs> oh, yeah, that was nice. We'll have some of that. Oh, 
you bastard! Come on! <laughs> wow. <laughs> this is gonna be hard to master, isn't it? Especially in this car. It might not be the best car to to start in. Yeah, way too much juice and no traction control. Yeah, definitely Mark, but that's that's the fun of it, isn't it? That's better. That's better. Yeah, that's much better. Oh, come on, no gold. <laughs> Hello, Jaffa, how are you doing? Right, do one more and then we'll start up a lobby. Get, get all your cars ready. Does anyone, can anyone remember what the Porsche was? It was N500, I think. We'll start with that. Look at any Porsche, they all look the same. <gasps> He's right. He's waving. Oh god, that's no good. That's no. Let me have one more. Let me have one more. Oh, it was N three hundred. Oh, even better. That's got a championship written all over it, you know. I must be tired. I didn't have very good sleep last night. I kept waking up. I think it's all that racing. <laughs> Hello, Nick. How are you? Yeah, they have, Nick. I was saying that. Oh, God, this is too far. Yeah, let's go to a lobby. <laughs> let's go to a lobby. <laughs> I think I'm really tired today. <laughs> Weird but nice, yeah, exactly. I think I was having high speed dreams. It's always hard to get a good night's sleep after a full night of racing. Yeah, it really is. I don't know how you lads are with it. Right, let's start up a lobby. N300. Here we go. We'll do it with BOP on. Too much kebab. <laughs> Way too much. <laughs> Who's coming in? Who's coming in? Uh, here we go. Is it just one variation? Probably. Where are you? Where are you? Okay. Oh, it's called... What's it called? It's called... Uh, I know it's called Laguna, but it's probably called something else here, isn't it? Fucking hell, where is it? Oh my god. Someone point it out. <laughs> Someone point it out for fuck. Yes, yeah, WeatherTech, that's right, yeah. Yeah. Wow, where where is it? Oh god, can anyone see it? <laughs> what? There it is, there it is. <gasps> I was starting to get worried then. I was getting panicky. <laughs> Look at that, it's a lovely car, isn't it? The old GTI. Yeah, the word kebab got blocked last night. And it was Pete's wife's idea to replace the word... Because wank goes through, but if you type kebab, apparently it doesn't. A bit weird. And she just come up with the idea to replace the word wank. Uh, replace the word kebab with wank. <laughs> the jollies lasted for about two hours with the sentences we were having. Absolutely crazy. Tartan fabric, yeah, on the interior. They were a bit like Mercs, didn't they? They had very strange interiors, yeah. Right, let's get up on this Porsche and we'll have a slow drive around the track. Where is it? Where is it? Where is the Porsche? I broke that, didn't I? What, what, why is it? No, it can't be N300. It's not N300. Can someone check for me? It can't be. 
It can't be N N400. Can't be. N300, sorry. Did I change it? Maybe I didn't. <laughs> I didn't change it, did I? Yeah, I know. I'm really tired today. Yeah. I'm just thinking of all the work I've got to do this afternoon. That's it. Here we go. Here we go. I mean, she's a beauty. Right, we're going to have a slow drive around the track now. That's what we're going to do. Let's level all this up. Use some of my mileage points for something. Let's see what she sounds like. Oh, we've got a look, proper look behind. Yeah, that's nice. I like that. Oh, God, yeah, yeah, we've got this long pit lane. Yeah, he's like a beetle, yeah. Right, so we're just going to have a nice little look around the track. That's what we're going to do. Nice bit of detail over there. Oh, they do they do do them so well though, don't they? Yeah, because this is it's got eleven corners apparently, and obviously because of the elevation, it's built in the desert. And on the real track, I don't know how much they're going to simulate it in this game, but in the in in the real track, the track is full of sand, obviously because it's in the desert, and it that's why it's so such a hard track. I don't know if they're going to simulate that at all in the game. This sounds nice. This sounds very nice. Got the helicopter over there in the distance. Yeah, this is cool. We always have a slow look round. Oh, definitely, Stephen, yeah. Yeah, I wish I'd filled in this bloody survey, because I would have liked that. Is that the one with it stitched into the steering wheel? Which I would have definitely loved. Much like Willow Springs, yes. Yeah, for the sand, yeah. What's over there? <laughs> What's over there? <laughs> oh, I like the bits of oil and stuff. That's nice. Or the... Uh, yeah, it does look like oil, oil, doesn't it? I mean, this bit has always reminded me of um, Far First, to be honest with you. Oh, she is cool. Yeah, it's too late to do it now. Some server, I don't even know what it was, yeah. It's quite the elevation change, isn't it, for, for a racetrack. That really is an elevation change. Really is. And then it continues down here as well. It's proper, proper down here, here isn't it? I like the way they've done it, though. I like the sort of... The, the palette they've used on the track with all the skid marks. It looks old, doesn't it? Yeah, VR here will look lovely. I, I just love the fact that you can see other sections of the track. I love that. I, I'm still of the age where I remember racing games where they would disguise that and you wouldn't see it because the game hasn't got a program in. Now they show it and they also you'll be able to see the cars driving around, you know? Yeah, it's not even plugged in. Cool. I think that's pretty cool. It's a lovely track to have in the game, yeah. <laughs> it looks like you're uh, underwear. Oh, I like that. Oh, look at that. This is cool. What's this? What's this? Uh, what's this car like? What? Oh God, that really is slidey. I think they're going to make the um, the dust, uh, the runoff, really slippery in this. Is fucking hell! That really is a slippery car. Yeah, it looks cool, um, Potter. It looks really cool. 
Oh, that's a shame if it's that slippery. Bloody hell. I might have to, um, I might have to put a bit of traction on here. Yeah, I'll just change the bias. Whoa! Oh, the dashboard looks nice. Am I feeling Christmassy today? I'm a bit tired today, and I've I've got lots of work. I'm going to pay for having yesterday off. I've got so much work to do. Hey, <laughs> surf slipping as well. Cool though, once we tame it and once we uh, tune it, it'll be fine. No, this is it, I'm afraid, today. Yeah, no, actually, no, tell the lie. Um, I will be back tonight. Me and Max are going to do some Star Wars tonight because he's finished school. My wife's going back to her school for um, the school party, the, the, the uh, you know, like the adults, you know. Um, so, yeah, we're going to be streaming later. Whoa, so keep it straight, boy, keep it straight. Yeah, you're right, Donny, you're right. It's already getting better. We're gonna try the um GT in a minute as well. If you um if you have got the game and you wanna wanna <laughs> wanna come into the lobby, it's all good. So he's probably doing that on purpose. Yes, he does love a bit of drifting, doesn't he? I love the look behind view. I really do. I'll be only on for another half hour or something, Paul. Unfortunately, it's going to be a short stream today. Hello, Giants. How are you? Uh, it's probably the car and the grip uh, a bit 50-50, really. It's one of them ones, don't you dare brake on a, on a bend, don't you dare. Yeah, see you later, Potter. What a great Christmas present from Gran Turismo, though. So with that pit lane, you're going to have to go all the way down there, aren't you? Because otherwise you're going to get a huge penalty, I imagine. That would be interesting. I wonder if the penalty be, would be worth it. <laughs> That's the wrong line, isn't it? You've got to go wider there. Oh, good eye. Good, um, good question, Donny. Yeah, we'll have a look at the different variations, actually. Night and day. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good question. Right, let's do that now. Let's look at all of them. Yeah, we haven't got any. We haven't got any rain. Let's start right at seven thirty and see what that looks like. Yeah, sunset over the corkscrew would be amazing. Yeah, it just says, Chief, that, you know, the, the problem of you getting the penalty tapped on from someone else is gone. We'll have to see, won't we? I did get that. I did get that this week, actually. The golf tune's up to N300, yeah. Yeah, the track would be crazy. Oh, and it's the desert, I suppose. I mean, I know it does rain in the desert, of course, but, yeah, maybe where it is in North Carolina, maybe the rainfall just doesn't happen there. No idea. Right, this is 7.30 in the morning. This looks nice. California, sorry, yeah, California, yeah. What did I say, North Carolina? Or oh, Carolina. 
Told you I'm tired today, really am. Woke up like proper dead tired. Oh, the light's looking pretty there, I like that. That's nice. Oh, fucking hell! Just on the first corner! Wow! Wow, wow, wow. Can anyone remember what the Ford GT was? I want to say that's N700. I'm sure it is. I'm sure it is. Let's try it. I'm sure it was N700. Let's have a look. N700, yeah. Yeah, got you. Right, let's have a look at that and see what that's like. Oh, there it is. Using up all their mileage points. Awesome. It is nice. Yeah, it is a lovely car. Thank you for coming in, everyone. Please feel free to leave me a little cheeky like. Thank you for coming into this uh, uh, stream. I do appreciate it. We're just having a look at the new update. Trying out the cars and setting up a lobby. So if you want to come in, you're more than welcome to. It slips out the first corner. Let's try and enter. No, I know. It's just really slippery, that car. Oh, hello. <gasps> hello. Oh, this would be fucking beautiful in VR. Oh, I like this. Hello. Oh, God, yeah. This has got me straight away. Oh, I like the look behind for you as well. Yeah, this is more like it. This is the car of the, of the uh, the update. Oh god, yeah. <laughs> I like that. Yeah, that's that's good. Like that. Yeah, lovely interior. Now this this has got a championship written all over it. That's all right, Rise. You do as many dislikes as you like. Brakes! <laughs> Brakes! The Ford was... Oh god, how much was it? It wasn't expensive. Yeah, half a mil. Half a mil. Oh, this actually feels really cool. Yeah, just over half a mil. Hello, Shaz. Oh, thank you, Transport. Enjoy your bus journey, mate. Oh, this is cool. Um, and th this is exciting. This has made the track come alive. The Porsche was fine, and a good, good old classic car. But this now, look, it's instantly made the uh, the track come alive. That's cool. Really like that. Oh, I feel more alive instantly as well. Right, let's have some races. Yeah, yeah, let's have some races. How many people we got in? Yeah, nice. Right, we're going to have two lap races. Bit of a G GT Royale without chucking people out. Um, yeah, let's go. We can do this. This is going to be cool. Oh, sorry, sir. Don't worry. We're only two laps. You can come in. Yeah, we'll do We'll do a two... I'll tell you what we'll do, right? We'll do a two lap race on each um, time of day. All right? I don't know why I just tapped on there. It was like, like I'm typing it out. <coughs> Oh yes, this is lovely. Yeah, this has got me now. Just wasn't feeling it in that other car. It was a lovely car and it was great to see the track, but no, this is exciting. Yeah, of course you can join. Come on in. The interior is just awesome. Oh, fuck it out. Love the lights on that steering wheel. What's the other car that does that? It's a Ferrari. It might be the Enzo. Oh, look at the rear wing going up and down as well. Oh, God. That, that is really car porn. Oh, look at the rear wing on Wang. Fucking hell. Wang's rear wing. <laughs> we got Wang's rear wing, rear wing going up and down. Oh, God. That looks sexy as fuck. The circle rear lights as well. Look at that. Keep 
keep it clean. Yeah, see like transport. Hello Gary. This is exciting. I really like this. I think we can pretty much say this is gonna be a championship car. Not the next one, because I've already got that organised. That's cool. Very, very good. Yeah, this is the star of the pack, I think. It's just, make, it's just making the, the, the track, everything come alive more than the Porsche. Hello, um, GTR. Car feels lovely, Chance, yeah. It's, it almost feels like this track was made with this car in mind, you know, sort of, uh, yeah, like that. Whereas the Porsche, it was just a bit of a misfit, wasn't it? really working on their sound as well now aren't they you know this sounds good let's see actually let's see what it sounds like from out here Oh, don't worry about dislikes, I don't, I don't care about that. I care about the people that are here, it's all good. Right, let's do a different time of day and another two lap race. Uh, let's keep it going, I'm into this now. I've, I've, I've cheered up, I've buzzed up. I was feeling very tired when I've come on. Now, uh, now it's all good. Hello Mick, how are you? Yeah, all good Russ, thank you very much mate. Loving Gran Turismo at the moment, at the moment. just getting better and better, isn't it? I can't wait to have this in the daily race, that's going to be epic, isn't it? I imagine that'll be next week. <clears> Hi <throat> from Puerto Rico, nice on speed, what's the temperature out there, is it hot? It sounds hot. Super Formula, yeah, Super Formula would be good, yeah. I wonder, I wonder if, um, I should imagine they will do the daily race here next week, I wonder what car they would put that on. Right, let's change the time of day and go again, that's what we're going to do. No, that was no traction control. Classic formulas, yes, yeah, of course, classic. Oh god, there's, there's a lot going on here, isn't there? 10.30 cloudy, let's go to that one. Ready up for me, and let's go. Yeah, classic formulas would look good round here, yeah. Russ, we do that every Tuesday, mate. Every Tuesday night. Right, ready up for me, and uh, I'll just check there's no traction on there. I don't want traction, no, no. Oh, in real life, did you, Dolphman? Oh, okay. Yeah. Hello, Dougie. How are you? Yeah, we've been doing that for two years now, Russ. Yeah, we've done some amazing things in in um, in GT Sport. Every single year, we do a charity live stream, and so far as a community, um, I do 24-hour live stream at Le Mans at the same time that Le Mans is going on in real life. 
and I think we're up to about eight and a half, nine grand now. Um, race for charity, yeah, we love it. Um, I've got two PlayStations, so on a race night, I input the um, second PlayStation and run a live spectate mode. We do loads of stuff here, yeah. How much was the GT? Just over half a mil. Right, ready up for me, and we're gonna go. Right, this is 10.30, uh, our, uh, Spike and Johnny, quickly ready up. Go on Spike, get on it. Five, here he goes. Children's charity called the Melza. Yeah, we do it every year. Do it again in June as well. I want to get I want to get the charity to ten grand over for, over three streams. That's what I want to do. Yeah, it's very good, Cal. Very very good. Very story driven. You're gonna have to read everything. Um, you need to go through all the all the chat options to get to to get to get to know people. So it's a very chatty game. Yeah, very chatty game. But it's good. I've done two streams of it. Um, yeah. They're both on the um, they're both on the on the uh, channel, Russ. Yeah, it's the same developers as Fallout, or the old developers. But I'm just going to put a bit of traction on there to pull away. Oh fucking hell! I'm not sure that penalty system works then because Amasar, I hit Amasar, I'm sure it was Amasar that I hit. I don't think he particularly did anything wrong and yet he's got a three second penalty so I don't think that system um, of not passing on the penalties has made any difference. We'll see. Yeah. Look at that weird ring. It's not a problem, there's no salt in the chat or anything, we're only having a little practice this morning, there's going to be accidents. really cool and it weird some it just shows you need the right car with the right track to really bring it bring it alive the Porsche was good round here but it just it was frustrating and it wasn't really that exciting all of a sudden put this on here and now it's opening my mind up to like we were just talking about a minute ago what other cars super formula round here would be pretty epic I think that probably one of the most epic things you could race round here 1030 looks nice doesn't it 10.30 cloudy, that's got a nice little look to it. I oh, know, I think you'll like it, Cal, but I've done a couple of streams. Um, I was going to do a complete playthrough, uh, but one Death Stranding has got me. Please consider that, Cal, because I think you'd like that. And I... I, um, I filmed the third episode... Oh, sorry, school. I filmed the, fir filmed the third episode, and halfway through editing it, I, I realised that the mic had just gone... Yeah, so I was like, oh, for fuck's sake, you know? And I haven't been back to it since, but I will do. It's got some uh, choices in there that can impact different things. Yeah, it's a good game. Yeah, we don't need um, we don't need any any chat or what the fuck's in the chat. It's just um, it's just a practice lobby. Don't worry about it. It ain't race night, it's nothing, it's just a bit of a practice around this awesome track. Death Stranding is my game of the year, there's no doubt about it, and I love it. I was so gutted the other day, I put it on, and um, I loaded into the game, load my save up, just a black screen, just a black screen. Oh shit! So I did. Um, I did a restart. Same. Reinstalled it. Same. I'm thinking, fuck you know. So luckily, I was able to revert back to a much earlier save. So I've lost some progress. But wow, that, I was gutted because I thought, right. As much as I love the game, I'm not going to do it again. Not this. Not this soon after doing it. You know. Right, so that was 10.30. Sorry about the crashes at the beginning. It's all good. It's just a practice uh, stream. Yeah, more Death Stranding. Absolutely, Russ. I'm 100% going to complete that game. Yeah, I've got the TGT, the Gran Turismo wheel. It's got me like a gobby on a meat hook. 
<laughs> I'm not sure I know what that means. Yeah, that's alright, Amazon. I wasn't moaning, I was just discussing the penalty. Enjoy that, Mark. Enjoy that, mate. Alright, let's go again. Um, don't get the T80, um, because there's no false feedback on there. Don't get that. Yeah. Yeah, don't get that. Not that there's anything wrong with it, but if you're going to get into racing, then you're going to want to want false feedback. Right, 12 o'clock, fine weather. Let's go again. I'm sticking with the full GT, if you don't mind. It's just that it's exciting, and, and it's the best way to learn the track, I think, with a car like this. So if you can ready up for me, that would be cool. <clears throat> yeah, G29 or Logitech T150 Pro. 149 in Argos. G29 all the way then. Yeah. Nice one, Rudd. Uh, Rudd. Rudd. Russ. Enjoy your day, mate. Stay safe up there. <coughs> yeah, all the T300, but obviously if he's looking at a T80, he's looking at a budget wheel, isn't he? So the next one up is the T150 Pro. I haven't drove the Golf yet. We'll do that on the last one. Right, Mr. Adams, if you can ready up for me. Five, four, three, two, one. Let's go. How can you guys learn the track so quick? Um, well, like Cal said to you, I have raced this many times, not on this game. But I think, like I said to you before, that they're just corners, aren't they? The same as any racetrack, it's just corners. you just got to look at the apex and just just go slow and, and, and move it up that way. They're only corners. These corners are no different to Dragon's Trail or any corner. It's just learning it, isn't it? A <laughs> donk! A <laughs> donk! Oh god, someone's off. Thanks, Beard. Now, I'm terrible at explaining things, right, but I went on an advanced uh, bikers course and the uh, I'm going to be terrible at explaining this and I'll probably get tongue-tied and won't be able to explain it to you properly, but hopefully you'll be able to decipher. A good way to read the road, right, is look in the horizon at, at the road. Now, when the, where the two points meet, if there's, if there's quite a width between the two points, can you see that? The, the, the two white lines, let's talk about the white lines, right? The white lines, they're quite far apart. That means the, a, the, 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 the apex or the turn is nowhere near. Now, can you see, no, not that corner. Right, you'll see in a minute. Right, the, the two white lines are quite wide apart, so you know that's a, a nice, easy corner. Right, look at them here, they start to get closer together, so you know that's a tighter bend, and that's how I read it. That's how I read it. I'm shit at explaining things like that, that are technical. But look here, look, the white lines were almost touching them, which means it's a tight one. Oh, I'm sorry about that. I don't know if you can decipher what I'm fucking going on about with that, but it works. Look, the two white lines further apart. Yeah, so you, you can just keep piling on. Oh, look, they're almost touching there, so you know, you know that there's going to be a tighter corner, right? They've gone wide again, yeah, wide. You can just read it, literally read the road as you go. Look, they're tight here. See that, they're tight? They're on top of each other. It's in the horizon, the white lines are almost touching. Again, look how tight they are. They're cl how close together the white lines are. Now they're getting wider, so we know we can cane it. That's, you know... Now, I'm, a, I'm, a, oh, I'm not a biker now, but I was a biker, and I went on an advanced course, and that was the main thing I come away with. 
you know how do how do you how do you go down country lanes and just fucking pile on the pressure and go fast unless you know it that's how you do it that's how you do it and it worked it worked i do it all the time that's what i look at even when i'm out uh, so the tighter they are yeah if they're if they're touching in the horizon or or or, or yeah, oh, it's so hard to describe but if they're If if the if the bend is coming round and you can see the two the the road disappearing, that means it's tight. Um, if you can see both sides of the the white lines, it means it's a loose corner. You know. No, I think no. I, I know what you're saying, Graham. Yeah, and I know it. I know it seems obvious, but when you're doing 70, 80 mile an hour on the bike, you need you need some kind of um, map in front of you. And that's the best. You need to be able to read the road. It was an advanced bikers course for road. And it wasn't tracks. Obviously, you'd learn the track, wouldn't you? You could do it blindfolded in the end, not on a bike. It was about reading the roads, how fast you can do the roads that you don't know. That, that's what it was about. Hello, Dead. Like I said, I'm a bit shit at um, passing on information like that. <laughs> but hopefully you got the gist of what I was saying. Right, let's go to another time of day. Let's go to the golf as well. Do something completely, completely different. But regards to learning tracks, that's a bit different because the track is the same every time you go round, and that is just a case of practice. The information I was given there really was first time stuff, you know. If you're only going to go down road uh, down the road once, that, that information is useful. Uh, racetrack, just keep doing it, didn't you? Right, let's have a look on this little golf. I don't think we're going to need traction on here, are we? We're just not going to. Oh, you should do, Dead. It's, uh, I don't mean you should do, but you'd enjoy it. Alright, let's change a uh, time of day as well. Where was we? 12, fine weather. Let's go down to 2.30. Yeah, next time you're out, though, in the car, have a look at what I'm, what I'm, what I'm talking about with the, uh, the road on the horizon as you turn corners. And you'll see, the further away the the uh, the road is, the wider it looks in the distance, the faster you can go. If it just disappears to a point, you know there's a there's a harsh corner coming up. <clears throat> oh, definitely, Aaron. It works. It it works. Just trust me. Yeah, just use any car. Just use. Yeah, it's only a practice. It's all good. Yeah, ready up. If you've got the golf, use the golf. If not, it's it's not a strict... Uh, it's just a bit of fun. Yeah, this is PlayStation 4 only, Aaron. Yeah, lovely game now. And it's cheap as chips now as well. And uh, God, imagine coming into the game now. Just the access of cars uh, and tracks. <laughs> I miss getting stuck on the grid. Oh, God. I'll tell you what, though. We've made... we we. I've been playing this since day one. Streaming it since the afternoon it come out. Oh, we put up with some shit from this game, didn't we? People getting stuck on the grid. The amount of patience we have with this game. But it paid off. It paid off. Oh, God, look at this. Look. This is cool. It was worth it, yeah, because graphically, graphically, it looks like a PC game. It's just great. Hello, James. Oh, that's a bit weird. Had some decent pull away. Stream gone. Oh, just refresh it. Yeah, just refresh it. Sorry. Let me know if it's back.
Is it back? Yeah, sorry about that. And it weird, it um it went all laggy, didn't it? So that's probably my internet, yeah. It couldn't handle the power, yeah. Oh, everyone's left the room. That was weird. I wonder if that was me then. That must have been me, mustn't it? If the stream went at the same time. We're only left with a few of us. See if you can come back into the room. Oh, proper little handler though this is. I know, I jinxed it as soon as we said that. No, I think that was probably my internet because it was a bit weird how everyone left afterwards. The golf game seems rollable. Oh god, should we try it? Should we try it? Shall we try and roll the golf? Make it happen. Here we go, let's do it on external view. Here we go. Gonna go over there and break. <laughs> I don't think it's going to happen. Oh, this is a quite a nice little surprise, this car, actually. Right, we're going for the brake again. Let's put traction control up, because that will grip the wheels more, and hopefully we can roll it that way. Bit of camber, yeah, yeah, exactly, yeah. Right, we're going for this corner. Nah, it's too planted. It's too planted. Golf probably said, yeah, don't make it so you can roll it. Hello, Jack. Yeah, welcome, mate. Yeah, T150 is very good. T150 Pro. If you check out my channel, there's a full review on it. The reason I say the Pro... Oh, oh. You make it really stiff and it'll roll. <laughs> the reason I say pro is it's got decent pedals. Same pedals that I've got with this steering wheel. No, she's not going to roll. She ain't going to roll. I like the interior. Yeah, I like this car. This has definitely got a GT Royale written all over it. Oh, missed it. Yeah, yeah. As, as Slim says, the G920 is for the Xbox version. The G29 is um, PlayStation 4 and PC. Right, let's go Super Formulas. That's what we're going to do. Christmas just keeps getting better and better. Yeah, exactly. No, you won't have any trouble with the G29 or the G920. I haven't tried VR, it's not even plugged in. Yeah, I will plug it in though, to try it for this. Yeah, definitely GTR. The, the T150 Pro is lovely. Right, if you've got it, let's go um, su uh, Super Formula. So we'll, we'll do the time of day. We'll go to um, 6 o'clock Sunday, because we've already done 5 o'clock. ATS and ETS too. Yeah, it would be fine for that. Yeah. Right, okay, here we go. It's GRX. So if you have got a super formula, please bring that in. <coughs> oh, the uh, VR on the Ford would, would be really good, actually. Yeah. <coughs> Let's go uh, with this one. Just have a little bit of a practice. Ah, why have they taken the halo off? What? I didn't ask for that. I'm quite. I can handle a halo. What the fuck? What have they done that for? Oh. I 
the 24 hours of a fucking Halo, Gran Turismo. I don't need it taken out. Thanks very much. Oh, yes. Yes. Oh, look at that. Oh, this is lovely. Look in the rear view mirrors. Oh, fucking hell. Actually, it's quite nice with a halo like that. <laughs> <laughs> Is everyone ready? Let's go. We can have a couple on there, so don't worry if you uh, score. Don't worry, we'll do another one. Just start joining in, Pete. That's the only advice I can give you. If you don't join in, you're not gonna, you're not gonna get the, uh, the experience, are you? This is six o'clock, Donny. The last one, the, the the darkest one possible. Yeah, get a Logitech dead. Yeah, the Hori. Mm. That light in there looks beautiful, doesn't it? Yeah, they really are bumpy. Yeah, you don't want to fuck around with them. Hello, Sam. How are you? It's fine. It's fine. You meant to do that. Oh, that was a shame. It is quite nice with a halo like that, actually. You know it's there, but... I mean, that's how you see it in real life, isn't it? Because it's in the middle where your nose is. You sort of look around it anyway. I don't think it's as... Um, blocking as it is in the game in real life. I hope they haven't taken it out for VR. Right, let's go again in the in these cars. Let's go again. Yeah, we need to go again. Yeah, it does look better to get a proper view, and you can do that on. Um, uh, oh God, uh, the Formula One game. <laughs> Oh, 
Nice one, Paul. Yeah, get in here, mate. Get in here. Yeah, there is that, Donny. That even if it does block your view, you, you know, you're you're rarely you're rarely just driving on the straight. Most of it's corners, in which case you're looking into the corner anyway, so you don't see it. Right, let's have another one. Hello, Minas. How are you? Right, Scorp, are you uh, readying up and you can play in this one? We're going to go again. Let's go back to probably what was my favourite, actually, which was 10.30 Cloudy. I really like that. Oh, of course, it's got to load the track. This is probably why we're never going to have dynamic um, time of day be or, or weather, because each track is a separate entity, unless they can stitch that together somehow. Yeah, ready up, um, Scorp. This is cool. I'm enjoying this. I must go soon. I've got so much work to do today. It's crazy. I skived all day yesterday, just streaming and playing games. <laughs> I've got to go and do some work. Right, ready up for me, please. Yeah, exactly, Duffman. Yeah, but I'm sure in the next one, it will be good. That's it, Paul and Scorp, if you can ready up. <laughs> Work needs to take a back seat when it comes to games. <laughs> right, Scorp, press the green tip, mate. Uh, tick, mate. I'm, I'm <laughs> green tit. Press the green tit, Scorp. <laughs> well, you was already in, Scorp. Oh, it might, it might have. Um, you've been in for a while, and if you haven't got that green tick, then it's probably. I'd probably go out if I was you. Yeah, I'd say you got a problem. I'd come out of the room and go back in. Don't worry, it's only two late race. We'll do another one. Yeah, I'd say cuts come out and go back in school. I think ten thirty looks. Um, oh god, you ain't got a, a green tick either. Go out, come in. I think eleven thirty looks the most realistic in my mind. You don't even see Paul and Scorp in the name list. Oh shit, it's happening again. Oh god, <laughs> it's happening again. We've introduced some new features for Gran Turismo. I think this is going to kick everyone out, you know. It doesn't normally take this long. Oh, shit. Okay, it might be right. <clears throat> yeah, time of day, it doesn't look video gamey with great big um, sun rays. It looks, it looks realistic to me, this uh, particular time of day. Right, let's try and have a nice race. Nice and clean. Right, let all you lunatics go, then I'll take you one by one. Uh, well, I'll be working up there all over Christmas when I, yeah, but work-wise, they'll close, they're not opening Christmas Eve, I'm going to give them Christmas Eve off this year, because next year we'll be full retail in the shopping centres, so we'll have to open. So, 23rd.
bloody cool car to race around here. Yeah, that's alright, Joel. Um, check out my review. It might give you some information that could be handy. Just type in T150 Pro um, into my channel and you'll see the review. I set it up with uh, Bustin. Bus. <laughs> Bus! <laughs> Right, I made it through the pack, um, but I think Giant's got a nice old lead there, so we couldn't do it. Let's do another one. Would you take this GT Sport on PlayStation 5? Uh, what do you mean by take it? Um, do I think they'll have it? Yes, yeah, I think so. Check the wheel, oh god. Check the lights, check the wheel, check the tyre pressures. Fuck yeah, now. <laughs> That was that was too much. <laughs> Check the passengers. <laughs> Look at that livery, Paul. Uh, no, sorry, Pete done me that livery. Love it. I love the Lotus um, livery anyway. The JPS. Everyone up for another one? <laughs> Come on. I'm into this now. It's only eleven o'clock. Eleven o'clock. <laughs> Let's go for. Uh... I tell you what we we'll do. Let's go. Okay, okay. We're gonna go GR three now. All right. We're gonna go GR three. And we're gonna go. Um, we're gonna go back to Sunny. Here we go. Well, I think what will happen is, Donny, is that this will evolve into the next title. I can't, I can't believe for one second that they're developing this title, making tracks for this, and then they're going to make them all again for GT7. I think this is the grounding, the physics, the everything. All the cars are the grounding for Gran Turismo 7 on the PlayStation 5. That's what I think. So I think we're already playing GT7. There's no way they'll develop all of this and then develop it all again. This is the game. Right, ready up. GR3 round here. Let's see what that's like. This should be interesting. <laughs> that's the game doing that. That is the game doing that. That is not me doing that. Oh, fucking hell. Gran Turismo, what are you doing? ha. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, fucking awesome. <laughs> My man's having a fucking fit. Look at him. They're all doing it. They're all doing it. <laughs> oh, my God. I'm not going to come out of it. I just want to see this. It looks cool. <laughs> I just want to see the others doing it as well. <laughs> Fucking hell! That's classic, that is. <laughs> <laughs> oh god, I love game bugs. Sometimes they really make me laugh. I love it. <laughs> that was a good one. Nice playtesting! <laughs> oh god. That was classic. Let's see if it does it again. <gasps> oh my god! It, it fucking hell! It is actually a proper bug. Shit! So that. Oh my god! That's a proper one. Yeah, I know start race. I know that. But we like to practice to get. It must be GR three. It must be. <laughs> Change the time of day, yeah, maybe. Wow. <laughs> Fucking hell. Yeah, we like to just go out on the track and practice, but Grand Turismo says we can't do that. That's epic. That's brilliant. I fucking love that. <laughs> no, we don't want to try another class. I want to race GR3, you know? <laughs> A new glitch for Christmas. 
Oh god, I can't. It don't look like I can ready up either. It's completely fucked. Oh no, here we go. No, it's fine. I'll start a new room, don't worry. Let's just try it one more time. Whew! It's fine. Right, see if you can come in now, and then if not... See, you can't get in now, Paul, yeah? You can't join anything. Let's do a new room. Let's get the lads in. Let's do a new room. <laughs> that was epic. I love that bug. <laughs> and when I look round, everyone's doing it. Awesome. Uh, right, here we go. Blah, blah, blah. We're going down to... Where is it? It's there. I can see it, but I can't see it. Oh, God. You know when you can't see for looking? WeatherTech. GameTech, WeatherTech. Right, uh, let's go GR3. Right, come in, lads. Last couple, the last two races, and I must go and do something, because otherwise I'll just sit here playing games all day. Yeah, of course I'm snowy. I need to catch up to where I left off, because I had to revert back. Luckily, I love the game, because it's, you know with me, there only needs to be a small barrier like that. A bit like Outer Worlds, really. Um, filming an episode with no sound and sort of thinking, oh, I'll do it next week. I'll do it next, then I don't go back. It's almost like I need to get back on the horse, you know? But I do want to play DS, uh, so that's totally fine. See you later, Dougie. <clears throat> Thank you for coming in, Wardy. Don't do it. It's fine. Right, quick practice, and then we'll have a couple of two-lap races. Then I'm going to go for the day. Actually, not for the day. I will be back tonight with Max. We're going to um, continue our Star Wars adventures, but we're going to do it together. This should be nice in this car, actually. What the fuck's going on over there? Did you see that car appear? How did it appear there? <gasps> Fucking hell, always test it, Gran Turismo. Always test the tracks. It's, you know, call me, I'll do it. It needs testing. And when I say testing, just press the accelerate and see what happens, because that was a bug immediately. Right, hopefully you've all readied up. Let's go. Right, two races, this one and one more. <clears throat> but thank you for coming in. Please feel free to leave me a little cheeky like. Feel free to subscribe. It's all good. I don't only do Gran Turismo. We do a bit of everything here. Oh, the GR3s do look good though, don't they? They really do. Yeah, we used to do that years ago, MSR. I don't think it does anything, to be honest with you. Right, a little bit of traction on the pull away. Does it, sir? <laughs> it is weird. The, the, the view is actually already quite high, isn't it? Stay at the back. I'm going to take you all out. Let's go.
Oh, 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 it's fine. I've got it. I've got this. Getting settled in there. We just needed a little bit of practice time just to get used to this version. It's a lovely looking track, very, very well done on Gran Turismo. I don't know if it's laser scanned, I mean, I'm guessing these days the information is just readily available for them to make the track. Whether they still go to these places and laser scan, I've got no idea. But it all feels proper and good. I'm sure they do, just for a bit of a jolly, didn't they? They go, oh yeah, we're putting Laguna in. Do you want to use the information we've already got? What? No, we're going to need to go there on Aldi for three weeks to go and measure it up. <laughs> Right, one more race. Tell me what um tell me what class you want. Should we do GR4? We've got one more race, what do you want? American muscle. Oh, I don't know about that. Yeah, let's go GR4. <laughs> GR1. Oh, are you on a death wish, gods? Wow. You just want to see me fail, don't you? <coughs> carts. Cart. Carts. Carts. <laughs> carts. I'm tempted, but I think we'll go GR4. Carts. Mm. That could be interesting. Right, we're going to go GR4. Last race. And I'm going to go in the TT because I loved it so much last night. Let's see how the pit is with the, with the TT. I'm dreading it. We're fine. It must have just been that one. Awesome bug though. If you've got hearts on, you can use super softs. We need a long race round here, don't we? Yeah, a good, a good four hour endurance, something like that. Right, everyone ready then? A few's got a hard-ons. <laughs> no, I meant the tyres, you dirty little git sir. A few of you have got hard-ons. <laughs> Trust you, sir, for fuck's sake. <laughs> I've noticed a few of you lads have got hard-ons. <laughs> okay, now. Right, last race. Then I'll be back uh, tonight about 8 o'clock, me and Max for a couple of hours, having a go on uh, Star Wars. Right, let's go. Now watch out for people in front of you, don't just hit them.
I didn't even know about this survey. It shows how much attention I pay. I mean, who fills in surveys, you know? No need, Graham, it's only a little practice room, it's just a bit of fun today. All good. Yes, yeah, so this is the last lap of the last race of the morning. Hope you enjoyed the stream. Feel free to install it, enjoy it, come and join us. We'll be having lots of community races around. Laguna, there's no doubt about that. It is an awesome track, yeah. Great inclusion. You know, this and Spa, within a matter of months, that's pretty good. Yes, of course, it should have been there to start with, but it wasn't. Let's get over that. So the fact that we've got them now, brilliant, you know? Yeah, of course it should have had it. But you can't have everything, can you? You know? If your auntie had a cock, it'd be your uncle. You know what I mean? You can't have everything. <laughs> Silverstone. It's got to be Silverstone. Not. It's not even a, a favourite track of mine. But it's got to be Silverstone or Monaco. Monaco, I'm not too fussed around. It'll just be a fuck fest around there, wouldn't it? It's got to be Silverstone. Fucking hell. You know, Silverstone is missing from this racing game. It has to be next. Hello, uh, gamer. How are you? Has to be next. Come on. Already in the game, James. Right, we're gonna have one more. Let's just have one more. Same again, ready up and we'll go. Then I'm going off for the day. <coughs> Same again. Yeah, all set for Christmas, thank you. Yeah, got lots of work to do, which I'm going off to do in a minute. No, I'm not addicted now. I just don't want to go and do real work, that's all. Right, same again. Last race of the day, absolutely. <clears throat> Last of my Christmas cards, sent out minus one. Send it to someone else, Pete. <laughs> right, let's go again. Nice and quick. Bosh, let's go. Playing Red Dead Redemption 2 in 4K. It's not in 4K, funnily enough, James. Unless you're on the Xbox X, I think. I don't think it's 4K on the PlayStation 4, is it? Someone correct me if I'm wrong. Looks 4K, but I don't think it is 4K. It's Pro Enhanced, but I don't think it's 4K. <clears throat> Maybe the Xbox X version is. Yeah, upscale, but it's not 4K, is it? It still looks lovely regardless. <laughs> Checkerboard, he's like, yeah, whatever that is. And 
don't really know. <laughs> oh, sorry, you were just saying you don't know, yeah. He wasn't doing a Mavis impression. Oh, beard, 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 beard. Don't you wow me for my Mavis impression. I don't really know. <laughs> my car's fucked already. You know, my last race. Hello, Andy. Oh, yeah, late mark. Yeah, you got a late mark. It's going to be so hard up here judging each other's breaking points, isn't it? Don't say that, gamers, because I'll have to have some now. Little shit, you've just made me have a portion of chips now, gamers. Hello, demon. Yeah, 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 part of the update. Yeah, fucking Laguna, mate. You're missing out. Get on it. Get on it, bruv. Sorry, I don't know why I'm talking like that. He was behind the bike sheds having a kebab. You're from Essex, that's why. Get out of it. Mr. Checkerboard. You've just made my stomach go all hungry and like, oh, chips. Deep fat fry. Oh, Andy. Poor teacher. Who is it? Who was it? Mr. Smith, Andy. Was it Mr. Smith, was it? Again. Or was it Mr. Johnson? <laughs> Bullshit does it. It was never going uphill, was it? It's always been like this and you know it. Bosh. Right, that is it everyone. The cool screw is going down there, yes. That is it everyone. Hopefully you've enjoyed the uh, the stream today. Have a lovely rest of the day. I will be back about 8 o'clock with some Star Wars. That's it everyone. See you later.